taking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's the Crypto Lightsaber back with another video, guys. We're going to talk about a project called Kiseki Wallet. Okay, this is having a fair launch pre sale on Pink Sale. We will go over the details for that. You've got plenty of time to get into this project, right? But um, I want to share this because these wallet plays, from what I've noticed, my experience with them in the past, right? They've got a decent website, decent tokenomics, zero tax like this particular token has. They tend to pop when you hold onto them, uh, you know, even over a short period of time, right? Uh, one example I'll give you. There's another one I shared on the channel at some point, right? If we're going to look at the chart for uh, a project that I shared a while ago called Black Wallet or Black Token, right? Um, so if we go to Black Token, you see that this project went absolutely nuts after its fair launch. Okay, guys, this launched in December. Okay, guys, and at the beginning it went down, but over time we see this massive pump in this chart, and it's currently sitting at five million market cap. All right, guys, this is why I like these wallet plays because they can actually bring you some really good gains in a bear market. So I think that Kiseki, um, the team is vouched for. I have heard from somebody who's in contact with the team. Okay, guys, they reached out to me to do a video on this project. But the website looks pretty decent. They've actually got audit with solid proof, right? And if they can execute, I think there's no reason why this can't pop. Okay, guys? So Kiseki Wallet, of course, is a wallet. Okay, guys? So it's going to have utility. And you're going to be able to trade different tokens or store different tokens and so, and so on, right? And they're also doing an NFT, okay? So the NFTs are gonna be available also on an airdrop for the first 50 members, the ones that are not for sale, right? The ones that are, um, the ones that you can get as an early investor. There's 50, sorry, is it 50 NFTs? Yeah, there's 50 investors. In fact, it says it right here. So there's a guaranteed NFT airdrop for the first 50 investors, exclusive super rare NFT for uh, top investors, random airdrop to 10 investors every day, Applic applicable for a minimum 0.5 BNB buy, that is in the pre-sale, okay guys, so if you come over to pink sale, and you put in at least 0.5 BNB, it's going to make you eligible for uh, one of these NFTs, if you're in the first 50, okay guys, unfortunately, there's only 7 spots left for you to uh, be in the top 50, uh, well, so it's the top 50 people about 0.5 BNB. So I don't know how much of each of these total contributors have put. It is very early, okay, guys. Um, so you know this is gonna probably gonna fill up quite a bit. And um, it's a 50 BNB soft cap. It's raised a 31 BNB already, and it's three days left, okay. And what you'll find is, as these pre-sales draw to a close, you see a lot of BNB starting to flow in. So I'm very confident that this will actually fill its soft cap. Probably won't be a big deal to hit that. Um, so the focus is on security, accessibility, interoperability, customization, data visualization, responsive design, compliance. The wallet is designed to meet needs of users at all levels and technical expertise. This is going to be available on the Google App Store. Is it Google App Store? Google Apps, Google Play, sorry, and App Store. And it's going to have the quick swap mode, sniper bot, governance, launch pad, all of that sort of stuff. So... Might as well say this now, this is not financial advice. Don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. It's just a YouTube video, okay guys? So make sure you do your own research when you're investing in these things because you could lose your money. But um, yeah, I've got news that, you know, this seems to be a pretty good team and, um, you know, they could potentially make this a success. I've already told you why I think that this has a chance of at least making short-term gains. All right, guys, what is the long-term potential? You would have to kind of speculate on that yourself. But um, it is web free at the end of the day. And, you know, if it's got its own app on Google Play and App Store, of course, that's going to be pretty bullish for it in the long term in terms of its, you know, success potential. OK, guys, so they've got a roadmap. Um, let's just have a look what they've got in the roadmap. OK, audit and KYC. We can already see that it has been audited with solid proof. And um, if we go to pink cell, right? should be able to click these links. Always do your own research, guys, okay? But you click the link and it should tell you all about the audit. And when you look on the audit, you're gonna see things like this, right? It says there's two issues, very low tier security issues, okay, guys? And when you look over here, what you'll find is that it's basically the ownership is not renounced. Now, a lot of people look for renounced ownership, decentralization and stuff like that. With something like a wallet, you can't really uh, renounce ownership because it needs to be, it needs to have some form of centralization in terms of 
you know, adding new tokens to the contract, all that sort of stuff. Okay, guys, so that's nothing to worry about. But of course, do your own research, check out the details for yourself. KYC, let's have a look at KYC. Okay, so they've got the KYC with solid proof. So it's not fully doxxed. However, at least solid proof know who these guys are. They would have had to submit their IDs, their uh, addresses and things like that. And that was done pretty recently on January the 18th. All right, guys. So, um, yeah, everything looks good on the surface for this project as far as we are aware, as far as we can see from the audit and from the KYC. Okay, guys. Um, onboard influencers. Okay, this is a sponsored video. So let's hope they're reaching out to much more influencers, Twitter calls, Telegram call groups, all that sort of stuff. And that, of course, is going to assist the marketing push. That's going to assist the price action of this particular project when it goes live. I'm not sure when it's actually going to go live. I would assume that it's probably within 24 hours after the pre-sale ends. And, of course, I said the pre-sale is for another three days. So this will end on the 3rd of February. Um, but what I would recommend is you jump into the Telegram if you want to ask any questions. Um, I haven't actually joined the Telegram yet. I think I better do that. Okay, 968 members. And while we're on the subject of telegrams, I do recommend you come and join me in my telegram, right? Because not every project or every pre-sale makes it to uh, video. All right, guys. Uh, for example, this is one that we've recently shared in the group. Okay, website looks pretty decent. This is one that we're looking at. I've heard this one is going to be a good one as well. But this one ends in a few hours. Okay, guys. If you want details on that, come and join us in Telegram. And uh, you can take advantage of that pre-sale too. All right, guys. But Kiseki looks pretty good in my opinion. I think we can definitely get a pump out of this. I really like these wallet plays. And um, yeah, ultimately, the success depends on the team and the community. All right, guys. So play your part. Be a community member. Go and join the Telegram group. And the rest is over to you guys. So let me know what you think in the comments. Do me a favor and subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed already. If you tick the little bell, it's going to notify you when I actually upload a video. If you like the video, that's going to help with the YouTube algorithm, guys. That being said, it's the end of the video. I will see you guys in the very next one.